Hey, this is a quick take on the 2021 Ecker NSX. Um, it's a guided hybrid missile. I mean, straight up awesome. You look at the t you look at the front and you look at the back and you say, "Wow, this is an epic machine." Just straight up awesome with this uh, super handling all-wheel drive, uh, 3.5 liter twin turbocharged engine mounted behind the driver and combines with the uh, three electric motors to deliver 573 horsepower and 476 pound-feet of torque. And lightning fast dual clutch transmission it has, which is just straight up awesome, folks. I mean, this NSX isn't perfect, though. Um, and it's not, you know, in the same class as a Ferrari for, you know, F.A. Tributo. But, you know, it, is, it does cost $160,000, which puts it not in a Ferrari range, though. But it puts it up there with the Porsches and, then, and also the um, Audi R8. And... It has that same appeal and it keeps it right there as far as with the Audi R8, you know, which is more like that German Teutonic uh, performance uh, sports car. This is right in the game. But you, when you look at this and you look at the Audi R8, you expect this one to cost less than the Audi R8. I mean, you expect it to come under, say, about $50,000 underneath the R8. Because R8 has that, you know, it has that appeal to it, you know. It's up there with the uh, Porsches and the rest of them. Uh, but the Acura, you know, that's the only thing that I see with this. I mean, this has a sophisticated uh, appearance, blistering acceleration. It's economical and stop-and-go traffic. It's really responsive handling. It's comfortable, um, high-performance sports car. And it has the Honda reliability. It has a unique powertrain within a segment. But the negative parts of this is that it's, it's got the uh, interior materials. Uh, I mean, interior materials are nice, but it's quite plastically. Even when you look at the dash and you look at this, you can, all, you can tell you can look at this. I don't know if this is fake carbon fiber, but I tell you one thing. It doesn't really stand out. And interior, the dash really doesn't really, you know, it doesn't grab you like a $160,000 car should. So it's got a... Um, it's got what they call a subpar type of um, infotainment system. I mean, it's nice, but let's see if we got any uh, views of that. This is the best we can do, but I mean, just look at it. You really can't see it from here, but it doesn't really stand out, you know, like a $160,000 car should. And it has also, you know, it has the, uh, it has, you know, the trunk is actually up in the, up in the front. The engine is in the back and we'll see the engine in a second. I mean, you won't see the engine, but you'll see a lot of plastic holes. And you can almost only assume that the engine's underneath. It definitely is. But when you look at it, it doesn't really stand out. But it sort of reminds me of the uh, McLaren. You don't really see the McLaren engine that much, too, when you look, you know, from the back. So it does a... It's definitely nice. But $160,000, you know, either this or a Porsche, uh, which one would you choose? Guys, write down in the comment. Tell me what would you choose, either this or a Porsche. And it does, um, it doesn't really, uh, you know, it does a good job being an NSX with the technology and everything. But the hundred and sixty thousand dollars, I think it starts off at like a hundred and fifty-seven five hundred, but it doesn't, um, and it hasn't changed since two thousand sixteen. I mean, some things of it has changed, but it's really not super noticeable. There's no big, huge, super noticeable changes about the Acura NSX. But it's definitely, you know, you got the leather, you got the, you know, even here, I mean, I don't know what that is. It might be the name NSX, but that needs to be in something special. You need to be able to see that. It shouldn't just be sitting right here, you know, just like that. I mean, the, the gauges, I mean, here, it's just little things. I mean, but this is nice as far as I got the Alcatara right here, which is definitely, definitely nice, you know. And it's got the leather. And this is, of course, it looks like high quality plastic. And but one hundred sixty thousand dollars. I mean, I think it's on point for Acura NSX. But one hundred sixty thousand dollars. Ouch. This a automotive reviews. Thanks for watching. Remember, like, share, and subscribe. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends and subscribe for more interesting videos.